Hello, Angela. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Good teacher. And you? I'm very well, thank you. Okay, teacher. It's good to see you. Uh, me too. Oh, nice. Now you learn. <laughs> Excellent. Okay. So, is your computer okay? Yes. Um, oh, okay. Let's see. Ahí estoy ahorita. <laughs> ah, okay, good. I, I am, ¿verdad? I am. Ah, you can say my computer is working. My computer is working. My computer is working. Oh, nice. <laughs> it's good to know. Qué yes. bueno. That's good. Sí. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. All right. Teacher. Okay. Hi, Adriana. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Fine. Oh, nice. And you? Ah, I'm Un very well, thank you. <laughs> So we have Mayra, Margarita, Azalia, Melanie, and Ophelia too connected, right? Hello, girls. Hello, teacher. I'm driving to home. Oh my God, I'm sorry about that. How much time do you yes. need? How much time do you need to get home? I think, I think uh, 15 minutes. Good, excellent. Hi, Ophelia, Margarita. Are you there? Hi, teacher. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening. How's everything? Ah, everything. Ah. How's everything? How's everything? Ah, I'm fine. Fine. I, I, yesterday, I changed my hair. So yeah. I divine. I, 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 <laughs> I, I, I feel divine. <laughs> yes, I could see. I could see yesterday. I could see your different look yesterday. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> so this day, uh, uh, today uh, was a good day. Oh, nice! It's interesting. So you got a. So what color is your hair normally? Uh normally, well. Uh, blonde. Okay. Red. Red. Uh -huh. Brown but, and now black. Black. <laughs> but, but what is what is the natural color? Ah, uh, black. Black. Oh, okay. Now it's black. <laughs> Very. I mean, it's oh, it's I so think. black. <laughs> <laughs> but it looks yes. really good. But it looks really good. I, okay. Thanks. I have accept my reality. Re, <laughs> reality. <laughs> reality. <laughs> so you have accepted the reality that your hair is black and you want it black. <laughs> yes. Okay, it's good. <laughs> okay. So hi Maria, Azalia Melanie, Ada Patricia. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hi, good evening. Good evening, Hi, Melanie. Teacher. Hello, Maria. How good are evening. You? I'm very well, thank you. How are you? Uh, good, teacher. Nice. Good. Nice. It's good to yeah. know. So we have Jancy connected in this moment, too. Hi, Jancy. We have Darwin, too, Hi, right? Hi, teacher. Good Hello, good evening. How are you? I'm fine. Oh, nice. Very it's good. Hi, ah, you had a good day. <laughs> good. It's good to know. Yep. Thank you for sharing. Hi, Darwin. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How's everything? Uh, great day. Great day. You had a great day. Excellent. Very good. And you? I had a good day, too. So many things. I went to work in the in the in the morning. In the afternoon, I slept for a moment. I spent time with my child, with my baby. All right, so I played wow. with my baby. I went to church. Then I went to eat pupusas. So, a good day, a really good day. <laughs> Very busy. Very yes, <laughs> that's right, definitely. Five pupusas. Eat Sorry, five pupusas. <laughs> that's too much. Eat 
five pupusas. No, look. I'm in tip top shape. <laughs> I'm rich. Listen to my listen to my expression. I am in you are a big uh... sorry. <laughs> you are a drink uh or chata cool. No, no, actually I, I had a milkshake, a banana milkshake. Uh yes. No, no, but I don't eat much nowadays. Ahorita si le estoy bajando la comida, I'm eating less, okay? I'm a little worried. <laughs> Soy un poco preocupado. I'm a little worried. But right Don't now, worry. Be happy. No, in this case, I have to worry. <laughs> I mean, I'm getting, <laughs> I'm getting a little fat, a little chubby. So I need to worry. <laughs> okay, I need to be in tip-top shape, okay? I need to be in tip-top shape. Okay, let's see, Marie. Uh, Rosa is connected. Hi, Rosa. Good evening. Hello, good evening. How's everything? Hello. It's good. Oh, nice. It's good. It's good. Yes. Are you under yes, the too weather? Hot. Too hot. Are you uh, under the weather? Yeah. I'm under the weather. No. No, ah, you don't remember. Ya se le olvidó que es under no. the weather. No, right? <laughs> remember, under the weather is a little under sick. The... A little sick. Oh, no, no. No, no, only right. the mind. <laughs> ah, okay, very okay. Yeah. So let's see. Um, no, no. No, okay, very good. It's good to know. Let's see. Hi, Miguel. Hi, Miguel. Hi, teacher. How's everything? Hi, teacher. How do you do? How's, I'm very well. How are you? Uh, more, more or less. Oh, more or less. Are you uh, sick as a dog? My internet is bad. Ah, your internet is no, bad. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. You say I'm not sick yes, as a dog. Uh, I I I can the internet of my phone. Oh. I connected with the internet with my phone. Mm. Is 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 bad. I imagine. So the connection, the cell phone connection, is really bad in your place. Okay, yes, very good. Yes. So, okay, so let me pass the attendance then. Ada Patricia. Oh, Ada. Teacher. Adriana. Yes. Present. She's present, teacher. Okay, okay. I'm passing the attendance. Sorry, I forgot to tell you. Ana Michelle. Present. Angela. Present, teacher. Asalia. Present teacher. Good. Darwin. Present teacher. Flor. Present. Excellent. Gloria. Here. Very good. Carla. Carla is not connected yet. Margarita. Present. Very good. Uh, Maria. Present teacher. Great. Mayra? Present, teacher. Nelson? Present. Osmin? Pres present, teacher. Here, teacher. Very good. Ophelia? Here, teacher. Okay, Here. excellent. Are you driving, Ophelia? Okay. Rafael? Rafael Sandra Present teacher Rosa Present Jansi Present Zulma Present And Miguel Miguel Miguel. Present teacher. Sorry. Okay. Okay. No problem. Okay. Present teacher. Uh, okay. I, good good I evening, the, teacher. The ah, okay. no, no, it's okay. I put here already. Hi. Good evening, Carla. Present. <laughs> ah, a little late. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much. Okay, everyone. So, um, yesterday I remember uh, we studied. 
idiomatic expressions, right? We studied idiomatic expressions, okay? Uh, do you remember the idiomatic expressions we studied yesterday? Recuerdan alguna frase idiomática de la que estudiamos? Do you remember one? Rosa? Um, as sick as a dog. As sick as a dog. Good. So you can say, oh, I am as Take sick it, as a dog. Is, I am sick Take as a dog. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Call in sick. Call in feel sick. Under call in sick. Water. Feel under the weather. Excellent. Call in sick. Feel under the weather. What else? Call in sick. Call in sick. Go around. Uh, let's see. Uh, what's the matter? No. What's the matter? Uh, yeah. what's, what's the matter? What's the matter? Like, what's the problem? Okay, very good. What else? Come on. Go around. Go around. Go around. Like, there is something going around. Okay? Hay algo my, circulando. My stomach, is, my stomach is killing me. Good. My stomach is killing me. You can say my head. My head is killing me. Or my back. My back is my killing head. me. Okay? My leg. My leg. My leg. My leg. My leg. Yes, my leg is killing me. All right. Good, that's excellent. So do you have more? I must de la que estudiamos. Do you have more? Or that's it? Tip top shape. Ah, tip top shape. Okay. Tip what is I, I, tip top shape? I learned yes. I learned a new a new uh, idiom. Idiom. Oh really? What is the idiom? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I know my last leg. <laughs> Can you repeat it, please? Um on my last leg. I'm on my last leg. I, I think I know the meaning. Yeah. What is the meaning? <laughs> Estoy cansada. Estoy cansada. I'm on my last leg. That means it's yeah. like the last. I'm on my last. Yeah. Leg. Leg, right? <laughs> like leg. Yes. Leg. Okay. Leg. Yes. Okay, very good. Yes. Yeah, I, I knew it. I knew it. Okay. I like that. I like this one. Yeah, thank you very much. And you're missing one. Le falta uno todavía. You're missing one de los que vimos. One idiomatic expression. Sick. Yes, calling sick, but there's another one. Hay otro. There's another one. Can afford to a dog? A sick as a dog, you mentioned it. Yeah, there is something the going around. Okay. What's the matter? Can you afford to? Can afford to, okay? It's a one, okay? I can afford to go today. That means I have no time. I don't have yeah. time to go today. Ah, yeah? What is the other? Be up, be, up be up in one's ears. Be up in my ears. What is be up in my ears? Like, I am up in my ears today. Estoy ocupado. Muy ocupado. ocupado. Muy ocupado, right? Very busy, all right? Up in my ears, okay? Up in my ears, yeah? So basically, these are the idioms we started. Estos son los que estudiamos, okay? These are the idioms we started. Okay, very good. Now listen, uh, for the first activity today, uh, you are going to use these idioms. Van a usar estos idioms, okay? And here you have them, por aquí están. So uh, basically, uh, number one is as sick as a dog. As sick as a dog. What is this? What is the meaning? Muy enfermo. Muy enfermo. Muy enfermo. Muy enfermo. Good, muy enfermo. Under the weather? What is under the weather? Feel muy under the weather. Sentirse un poco enfermo. Un poco mal. Un poco mal, okay? Under the weather, good. There is something going around? Hay algo en el... En el ambiente. En el aire. Hay algo circulando, okay? Hay algo, algo no anda bien, okay? There is something going around, circulando. My stomach is killing me. Tengo un gran dolor de estómago. Mi estómago me está matando. You can say. Eso suena bien, literalmente. Okay. Good. Okay. Take, okay. Take it easy. What is take it easy? Tómalo con calma. Tómalo con calma. Like take it easy. O tómalo relajado, relajate, ok? Relaja. Take it easy, right? Tómalo tranquilo. Can afford to? Al final de la quincena. No puedo, no, puedo. no estoy, no tengo suficiente. 
¿Puedo darme okay. luz? No, yes. no Remember, tengo tiempo. No tengo tiempo, okay? I don't have time. Uh -huh. That's right. So you can say, for example, I can't afford to go to the office. No puedo darme lujo de no ir a la oficina. I can't afford to go to the office, okay? Yeah. Now the next one is calling sick. What is calling sick? Llamar enfermo. Para estar Llamar enfermo. Reportarme enfermo. Ah, reportarme. Llamar, reportarme enfermo. Reportarme enfermo. Llamar para decir que estoy enfermo. Calling sick, right? For example, you can say, I will call in sick because I am feeling under the weather. You can say, right? Yeah. What is tip top shape? En buena Estar en forma. Estar en forma. Estar en forma, en buena condición. Tip top shape. Okay. En buena condición. In a good condition. Very good. Now listen, applying the topic and applying this vocabulary, the idea is that you practice a conversation. Don't write the conversation this time. No estoy una conversación. Don't write the conversation, okay? Because you will change little. Le van a cambiar poquito. Listen, this conversation is on, uh, is on page number um, 33, okay? Page number 33. The idea is that you practice this conversation, but change some information. For example, you say, good morning. Good morning, this is? You don't say Mr. Reese, right? Yes, no vamos a decir Mr. Reese. ¿Qué podríamos decir? Miss, Miss, Miss yo. Ah, Miss yo. <laughs> so you can say, yo. Ah, so in my case, I can say, good morning, this is Mr. Martinez. And you say, hello, Mr. Martinez, this is uh, Darwin, for example, I have a situation, okay? And then you say, hi, Darwin, tell me, what's the problem? Tal vez esto lo pueden cambiar. Podrían decir, what's the problem? What seems to be the problem? What's going on? Okay? And then you continue. I'm not feeling well today. My stomach. En vez de decir my stomach, pueden decir my leg, my head, my... My head. My, uh -huh. my head. My head is killing me, you can say. Or my... My eyes, mis ojos, my eyes are killing me, okay? And, the, and then you continue. I'm as sick as a dog. Okay, under, I understand. Maybe, tal vez aquí no digan two days ago. Maybe la idea es como modificar la información, to modify the information. Maybe you can say a week ago, all right? Hace una semana, a week ago, I was feeling under the weather too. Oh, really? There's something going around. I hope you are feeling better. Eso va igual. Oh, yeah. I'm in tip-top shape. Take it easy. I hope to see you. Tal vez no ponga un Monday. Tal vez ahí ponen otra cosa. Maybe you can say, I hope to see you next week, la otra semana. The idea is to personalize, okay? Okay, thanks a lot, Mr. Martinez. Have a nice rest of the day, all right? Yeah? Good. So the idea is to personalize the conversation, okay? La idea es cambiar información o personalizar la conversación, okay? So do you have any question? No. no? Clear? Clear? Clear. This is on page number 33, okay? Page number 33, página 33, page number 33. Okay? Now listen up. Escuchen, listen up. I will give you like 10 minutes, okay? Don't write the conversation. No la vayan a escribir, solo practiquen, only practice. Only decide what the problem is, okay? Solo decidan mm -hmm. el problema. Only decide the problem and practice, okay? And switch roles. Y cambien roles. Switch roles, okay? Any question? Okay. No. No, okay, 10 minutes. In 10 minutes, you go, you think of the problem, and you practice the conversation. And after, you come and you present to the class, okay? Okay, let's go. You will work in pairs. Si alguien no tiene pareja, en el momento que los envíe, me, me pide ayuda, okay? You ask for help. Okay, let's go to work. Yo estoy con, como diría, I am, what? <ríe> con mucho calor. <ríe> ah. 
Hi, Sulma. I'm alone. You're alone. Okay, let me send you to a group. Let me send you with someone. Let me see if someone else is alone. Nobody. So you can go and work in threes, okay? Okay. All right. Uh, okay. The teacher is coming. The teacher is coming. <laughs> eh, no enciendo la, la, la cámara por lo mismo del internet, teacher. Oiga. It's okay, don't worry. I know you are practicing. Okay. Okay. Eh, Sería siempre good morning o ponemos otro eh, good afternoon. Le cambiamos. Cambiemos alguna lógica okay. más, teacher. Ahorita le cambié los nombres, ¿verdad? Sandra y, y mi persona. Good afternoon. Maybe um maybe you can you don't say my stomach you can say another you can mention my another head, problem. I have a headache. My, uh, my head is my killing head, me. My head, my hand. Uh -huh, mm -hmm. My head. My of head course. is killing me. My head is killing me. Uh -huh. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good morning. Good afternoon. Well, let me just change a little I have a situation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. the idea is to, to write it in a different way. Okay, okay, I have a situation. Hello, tell me what is the matter. I'm not feeling well today. My head is killing me. I don't see because I thought it's a serious one. Okay, I'm I understand. Well Two today. days ago, I feel in the rest of the world. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, the rest is okay. Maybe you can change only on Monday, okay? I hope to see you on Monday. Okay. Maybe uh, you can say, I hope to see you next week. Okay. Maybe okay. you can say next week. Next. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Have a nice rest of the day. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Re 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 really. Today's a go. Today's a go. Podemos cambiar or no? Yeah. Yeah. You can. Here? Maybe you can say a week ago. Hace una semana, tú, hace una semana puedes time, ponerle. A week ago. A week ago. A, a week. Week. A week. A week. A, a week, week ago. Mm -hmm. A week ago. A week. A week ago. Ajá, solo le borra. Así, sí, así, así. Ago estaba ahí. A, a week. week ago. Ajá, okay. yo me sentía un poco. Ajá. Oh, right. Comienza usted. Okay. Good morning. This is Carla. Hello, Carla. This is Gloria. I have a, a situation. Hi, Gloria. Tell me, what's the matter? I'm not feeling well today. My head is killing me. I am a sick as dog. Okay, I understand. Two days ago, I was feeling under the weather too. Oh, really? There's something going around. I hope you're feeling better. Oh, yeah. I am in TikTok shape. Take it easy, Gloria. I hope to see you on Monday. Thank you. Thank a lot, uh, Carlita. Have a nice rest of the, of the day. Okay. Change. Okay. Good morning. This is Carla. Okay. Hello, Carla. This is Gloria. I have a situation. Hi, Gloria. Tell me, what's the matter? I am not feeling what my... My eyes, pero dolor de ojos, como se dice. You don't have, ojos. You only, no, no, listen. You only have to say the part of the body. You say my eyes, my eyes are killing me. Mis ojos me están matando, okay? Mm. So it's like it's mm. okay. normal to infer the meaning, okay? Mm. You only need to say the part of the body. My eyes, my head, my back, my leg, I don't know, okay? So you only say the part of the body, okay? Yeah, he's killing me, you say. Mm -hmm. Killing me. 
I'm a sick as a dog. Okay, okay, I understand. Two days ago, I was feeling under, under the water too. Oh, really? There's something going around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh, yeah, I'm in TikTok shape. Take it easy, Gloria. I hope to see you on Monday. Thank you a lot, uh, Carlita. Have a nice rest of the day. Okay. Great. It's excellent. You have very good pronunciation, girls. Uh, thank you, teacher. Okay, very good. So you can practice again. Let me visit another group. Okay, thank you. Okay. Sure. Has an easier ha have an easy rest of the day is correct. Yes. Nice. Okay. Have Thank a you. nice. Have a nice. Have a nice rest. Have a of nice the day. rest of the day. All right. Nice. Okay. Thank yeah. you. A lot, Mr. Mr. Sanchez. Have a nice rest of the day. Okay. Chain? Floor? With me? Yes. You as you as that. Okay. Yes. Good morning. This is Mr. Sanchez. Hello, Mr. Sanchez. This is Sulma. I have a situation. Hi, Sulma. Tell me, what the matter? I'm not feeling well today. My head is killing me. I am as sick as a dog. Okay, I understand. Uh, Ned, uh, last week, day ago, I was feeling under the weather, weather too. Oh, really? There is something going around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh, yeah. I am in tip top shape. Take it easy. Sulma, I hope to see you on the morning. Thanks, Mr. Sanchez. Have a nice rest of the day. Excellent. Very good. Okay, now please, uh, on, in this part where you have last week and you have two days ago, right? But you have to decide. Tienen que decir, if you say last week, you don't say two days ago. Only one, solo una. Last week or two days ago, all right? Which one do you want to use? ¿Cuál quieren usar? Which one do you want to use? Last week or two days ago? Last week. Last week. Last Then week. you don't say two days ago. No van a decir two days ago entonces. Solo last week, ¿ok? Mm, yeah. Ok. Last okay. week. No, 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 no incluye ago. No, no. No, porque estoy diciendo la semana pasada. Last week. Ah, ok. Yeah. Only last week is enough, ¿ok? Ok. Last week. Next. Surma Flor. Okay. Good morning. This is Mr. Sanchez. Hello, Mr. S Ms. Sanchez. This is Sulma. I have a situation. Hi, Sulma. Tell me, what's the problem? I'm not feeling well today. Ma the flu is killing me. I'm as sick as a dog. Okay, I understand. Teacher. Hello. Hello. Osmin estaba en una reunión. Entonces ahorita ya le estoy diciendo los cambios que hice en la conversación. Él se va a ir para el chat, por eso no se ve su pantalla, porque está en el chat, porque no tiene impreso el libro. Ok. Ok, no problem. No problema. Okay. Así que. So we have one minute. Podríamos. Sí, sí. Yeah, Podríamos. Yeah, I... Podríamos. Yeah. Eh, incluir como otras expresiones o palabras, ¿verdad? Oraciones. Como yeah, that's para the, un contexto. That's the idea. That's the idea okay. to, to have a different problem. Es que yo lo, yo lo mando para el is. <laughs> ah, ok. Y yeah, que it's... me llame después para decirme. No le voy okay. a decir cuándo lo voy a ver. Que mejor vaya al is y que me diga. <laughs> ok, perfect. I like the idea. <laughs> ok, este, Margarita, ya estoy. Is, okay. Sí, sí. Okay. 
teacher, yo no me voy a ver en la cámara porque me voy a pasar también a digital el, al libro, pero no va a escuchar. Yeah, it's okay. No problem. Okay. Entonces sería, good morning, Didi. This is Mr. Osmin. Eh, Luego. Hello. Ahí le contestaría yo. Ajá. Pero si gusta, le voy diciendo lo que, los cambios que he hecho y ahí usted me va diciendo si está de acuerdo o no. Vale. Entonces ahí, me, primero va a empezar usted. Good morning, this is Mr. Osmin. Luego voy yo y le digo, hello, Mr. Osmin, this is Margarita. I have a situation. Luego me dice usted, hi, Margarita, tell me. What is the problem? Y yo le digo, I'm not feeling all week. My eyes are killing me. I'm as sick as a dog. Luego usted me dice, okay, I understand. Yesterday I, I was feeling under the water too. En vez de decir, Two days ago, usted me va a decir yesterday. Luego le digo yo, oh, really? There is something going around. You, um, I hope you are feeling better. Luego me dice usted, oh, yeah, I'm tip top shape. Take it easy, Margarita. Y ahí lo va a cambiar. Va a poner esto. You have to go to East. You have. you have to go to East. Tú tienes que ir al seguro, ¿verdad? Social, yeah. al East. Mm -hmm. You have to go to East. I hope see you soon. Eh, yo espero verte pronto. Tell me after. Háblame después. Your medical appointment. O sea, háblame después de tu consulta médica. Vamos a ver si me va a ayudar porque ya, ya me pone nervioso porque no sé nada. ¿Usted está escribiéndolo o no lo está escribiendo? Rayana. Have a nice. Ay, have a nice rest of the day. Bye. Creo que así está bien. Sí. La practicamos. Sí. Vaya, démosle. Okay. Good afternoon. This is Mr. Ayala. Uy, hello, Mr. Ayala. This is Anna, and I have a situation. Hi, Anna. Tell me, what's the situation? Well, I'm not feeling very well today. My head is killing me. I'm as sick as a dog. Oh, really? This week, I was feeling under the weather too. Really? I think that there's something going around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh, yeah. I, I am in one here to visit the doctor. Well, thank you, easy, Anna. And I hope to see, to see you on the next week. Thank you so much, Mr. Ayala. Have a nice rest of the day. Excellent. Great conversation. Good. Uh, maybe only in the part of Mr. Ayala, the last part of Mr. Ayala. Oh, yeah. I'm up in one's ears. You have to say, I'm up in my ears. My. Oh, you don't say once, my. you say my. Because remember that the idea is that you use the possessive, okay? I'm up in my okay. ears to visit the doctor, okay? But what is up in my ears? Estar como muy ocupado. Okay, yeah, it's okay. You have a good idea of, of, the, of this part, okay? Yeah, it's okay. Está bien, okay. it's okay. So, are you ready? Yes. Okay, you have, you have one minute. You have one minute to practice, okay? So, practice again if you want. Switch roles if you want, okay? Cambia en roles si quieren. Switch okay. roles if you want. Okay. Ay, solo que ya, ya no la veo porque dice 54 segundos. No, no, it's okay, it's ah. okay, continue. Hasta que el tiempo los corte. Until the time cuts you off. 
Ah, okay. pero lo puedo quitar. Ah, va, ok. Good afternoon. This is Mr. Ayala. Hello, Mr. Ayala. This is Anna, and I have a situation. Hi, Anna. Tell me, what's the situation? Well, I'm not feeling very well today. My head is killing me. I'm as sick as a dog. Oh, really? This week I was feeling under the weather too. Really? I think that there's something going around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh, yeah. I am in my shirt. Are you here? <laughs> Ok, I hope everyone finished, ok? I hope everyone finished. Espero que todos hayan terminado. So, did everyone finish? Yes, teacher. Yes, ok. Yes, yes. teacher. Ok, very good, that's excellent. No, teacher. No. Teacher. Yeah, Miguel? The teacher? Yes. It's not here. It's not here. Who? Who is not here? Miguel. Welcome back, teacher. Okay, okay, okay. Good. Okay, um, can you hear me? ¿Me pueden escuchar? Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes. No se escucha cortado. A veces. No. Yes. Okay, hold yes, on a I, second. I saw, I saw this. No sé cómo sería cortado. Se oye interferencia. Okay, okay hold on a second. Hold on a second. Pero yo no sé si es mi internet, teacher. No, I think it's my I think it's my internet. Creo que todos me escuchan cortado, ¿verdad? No. No, no, teacher. Ah, okay, no then, teacher. All right, then it's your internet, Miguel. I'm sorry. Sí, sí, es, es el mío. Okay, okay, everyone. So, uh, the idea in this moment is that uh, like three or four pairs share the conversation, okay? Three or four pairs need to share the conversation, but listen. Here in my head, in my head, my head is not, is not killing me, okay? My head is not killing me. So in my head, um, I will mention a letter, letter M, letter M. So whose name start with the letter M? Los nombres de quienes empiezan con la letra M. Okay, let me see here. Maria Estela, right, is one. Um, my name is Anthony. My name is Margarita. Anthony. Margarita, Miguel, Margarita, Miguel, Mayra. Mayra, Mayra, right, and only them, right, solo ellas, y ellos, okay, so let's start with Maria, Maria, who is your pair? Me. The microphone, Maria, the microphone, Maria. My partner is Rosalena. Okay, so are you ready? Okay. Yeah. Okay, we listen to you. We're all ears. Okay. Okay. Good morning. This is Miss Salgado. Hello, Miss Salgado. This is Estela. I have a problem. Hi, Estela. Tell me. What's the matter? I'm not feeling well today. My back is killing me. I'm as sick as a dog. Okay, I understand. Once month ago, I was feeling under the weather too. Oh, really? There's something going around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh, yeah. I'm in tip top shape. Take it easy, Maria. I hope to see you on Wednesday. Thanks a lot, Miss Salgado. Have a nice rest of the day. What's the day? Excellent. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay, that was excellent. Very okay. good. Thank you. Okay. Thank you for your participation, Rosa and Maria. Okay. So lucky you, Maria, because your name is with the letter M. Okay. So let's see another name with letter M. So it's the next one is, let me see here, Michelle, right? So Michelle. Michelle, who is your pair? Uh, Darwin. Okay. We're all ears. Continue. Okay, start. Are you ready? Yes, but I don't know Darwin. Darwin. Hello. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, so let's listen to them. Yes, 
Okay. Good afternoon. This is Mr. Ayala. Hello, Mr. Ayala. This is Anna, and I have a situation. Hi, Anna. Tell me, what's the situation? Well, I'm not feeling very well today. My head is killing me. I'm sick as a dog. Oh, really? This week, I was <laughs> feeling under the weather too. Really? I think that there's something going around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh, yeah. I am hoping to visit the doctor. Well, say, say, crazy, Anna. I might have to see you on the next week. Thank you so much, Mr. Ayala. Have a nice rest of the day. Congrats. Great conversation. Congratulations. Okay, thank you very much for your participation. Uh, Michelle and Darwin, thank you. All right, next we have, um, let me see, Margarita. Okay, Margarita, your name starts with letter M. So he's, who is your partner? Osmin. Are you ready? Practicamos poco, teacher. Okay, so. Yo do you... sí, pero no son me. Osmin, do you feel ready? Sí, este, voy a hacer este. Eh, yeah, solo que tengo un problema porque estaba en una reunión, copié poco, pero lo intentaré. Ok, perfecto. That's the attitude. Eh, lo único que como lo tengo digital, no me va a ver, teacher, pero sí voy hasta acá. Me va a escuchar. Ok, yeah, we will listen to your voice. It's ok. Ok. Eh, Empiece, Osmin. Eh, eh, one moment, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. How, no, no. Ah, me perdió. A mí también. Página 33. Sí, ya. Ya, ya. Página 33. Ok, ok. Good. Good morning. This is Mr. Osmin. Hello, Mr. Osmin. This is Margarita. I have a situation. Hi, Margarita. Tell me, what is your situation or your problem? I'm not feeling well all week. My eyes is killing me. I'm as sick as a dog. Okay, I understand. Today ago, I was feeling under the uh, weather too. Oh, really? There is something going around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh, yeah, I'm, I, I am a uh, TikTok chat. Uh, you have to can is I have see you son tell me after your medical appointment oh okay I have to go to east I hope see you thanks a lot Mr. Osmin have a nice rest of the day oh yeah okay okay thank you thank you, thank you very much Fantastic. I mean, okay. to be improvising is really good. Okay, thank you very much, Osmin and company. Uh, now let's listen to Miguel. Miguel, who is your pair? Uh, my pair is Sandra. Okay. Yes. <clears throat> okay, uh, uh, I first. Uh, good afternoon, this is Mr. Jimenez. Mm, <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Arita. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Jimenez. This is Sandra. I have a situation. Hi, Sandra. Tell me, what's the matter? I'm not feeling well today. My hair is killing me. I am a sick fellow. Okay, I understand. A week ago, a week ago, 
I feel in under the water too. Oh, really? There's some time going around. I hope you are feeling better. Oh, yeah. I am in good shape. Take it easy, Sandra. I hope to see you on next week. Thanks a lot, Mr. Jimenez. Have a nice rest of the day. Good. That's excellent. Good work. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, for your participation. Okay, so we have Mayra with the letter M too. Okay, Mayra Melanie with the letter M. Mayra Melanie, are you ready? Uh, no, teacher. I'm coming home. Uh, ah, I was okay. not in the groups. Okay, don't worry. It's okay. No problem. Okay. So, so I said right. Uh, thank you, teacher. Okay, no problem. Okay, I said letter M. So so it's okay. Letter M is enough. Okay. Good. Now let's go to the next activity. Now listen. Listen carefully and pay attention here. Um, yesterday, we studied idiomatic expressions, right? And we said idiomatic expressions don't have a literal translation, okay? Yes? So for example, if you say, um, I'm as sick as a dog, in Spanish, you don't say estoy tan enfermo como un perro, right? Yeah? So it's not okay. Right. No, está right. bien. So no literal translations for idioms, okay? Así que para las frases idiomáticas no hay traducciones literales. No literal translations, okay? For example, if you say, um, what, I'm under the weather. Estoy bajo el clima. It's like, oh my God, what is that? Estoy bajo el clima. So you say, I am a little sick, all right? So it's different. So no literal translations for idiomatic expressions, okay? Very good. Like when you say, for example, como cuando, decimos, como cuando decimos, perdón, like when we say, um, a tal palo, tal astilla. Have you heard that? ¿Han escuchado eso? Yeah. Yes. 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 How do you say this in English? Any idea? No. No idea. It's like father, like son. Yes, that's the idiom. It's like father, like son. Like son, yeah. Like, like. Like, como, como, okay, like, like mm -hmm. father, comma, like, like son. son. So imagine you say this literally. Imagínense que lo, has, lo traducen literalmente. Quedaría como padre, como hijo. Like father, like son. So it doesn't make sense, right? No tiene sentido. So you say tal palo, a tal palo, tal astilla, okay? So it's different, okay? So the translation is different. So I repeat, for idiomatic expressions, no literal no. translations, okay? No literal translations, okay? And listen. And for today, for today, we have another topic that is related. Otro tema que está casi relacionado, is very related, okay? We have phrasal verbs. Phrasal verbs. Like when you say, for example, hey, come on, come on, come on, come on. It's a phrasal verb, okay? Or like when you say, for example, um, let me let me think of one. Come down, come down. Ah, it's a phrasal verb, okay? So phrasal verbs change the meaning of the verb, or this preposition you attach changes the meaning of the verb. Like for example, it's not the same to say look like look, and to say look up. Okay, they have a different definition. Tienen un significado diferente. Look. And look up. Solo por ponerle up, el up, I change the meaning. Cambio el significado. Okay, I change the meaning. So for today, we have phrasal verbs. So please pay a lot of attention today. Ponga mucha atención. Pay a lot of attention today. Okay. So, but before, just before we start, we have um, a discussion activity. Okay. And in the discussion activity, we have. Um... Oh my goodness. Okay, we have some questions, okay? As always, como siempre. So the questions are, who is the person who, fix, who fixes damaged equipment in your company? Okay, who is the person who fixes damaged equipment? What are some pieces or components of equipment you have trouble with or problem with, okay? So what is question number one? Question number one is, ¿Quién es la persona que repara el equipo dañado? Who is the person who fixes damaged equipment? Question number two. 
What are some pieces of equipment you have trouble with? ¿Cuáles son algunas partes de los equipos con las que tienes problemas? ¿Ok? So please, take three minutes and answer the questions on your notebook. Three minutes, ¿ok? This is on page number 35, ¿ok? Es en la página 35, it's on page number 35. Ok, let's answer the questions. Page teacher. Page 35. Okay. 
Are you ready? Almost? Yes. Yeah? Yes, teacher. Yes, please. Uh, if you do me the favor to raise your hands. Thank you, Angela. Because I can see everybody is like a very focused, working, okay? So please, if you finish, uh, go to reactions and raise your hand so I see the people who finished, okay? Please. Yes, like almost half, casi la mitad. Okay, so let's wait one more minute, un minuto más, one more minute, okay? I am ready, teacher. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Let's wait for the others because some people are working. Okay, uh, time is over. So let's answer the questions because we need to go to the next activity, okay? So Carla, do you want to answer the questions? Yes, I did, teacher. You finished, okay, excellent. So yes. Carla, uh, who is the person who fixes damaged equipment? In my case, in the office, when we have a problem with a computer, a uh, first step is we show Sure, I raise a ticket and it department they put in a contact with, with the employees and review the equipment. If equipment doesn't, doesn't, does, doesn't fix it, it department put other ticket with the vendor for apply the warranty and the vendor do the change for another equipment or for another uh, part the, that this equipment. Okay, excellent, very good. Thank you very much, okay? So basically you uh, fill out a ticket or you complete a ticket to change the equipment, yeah? Ah, uh, yeah, yes. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much, Carla. I appreciate your participation. Um, can you please select a boy? A boy, uh, Miguel, Rafael. Rafael, okay, is Rafael connected in this moment? He was not connected at the beginning, but I don't know if it's connected. Rafael. Or, or Miguel. Hey, Miguel, okay, Miguel, are you ready? Hey, yes, yes, okay, I'm Miguel. ready. Who is the person who fixes damaged equipment, Miguel? In my, in my case, uh, it's IT support. Okay, that's excellent. What are some pieces of equipment you have trouble with? Okay, the, the pieces are hard drives, uh, cables, mouses, printers, headphones, memory RAM, laptops, batteries, energy source, screens, power cables, 
internet cables, modems, and switches. Oh my God, only technology. All right, thank you very much. Okay, thank you, Miguel. Yes. Thank you very much for your participation. Okay. okay. Maybe something important, okay? In plural, you, in singular, you say mouse, el ratón de la compo, right? And in plural, you say mice, okay? Singular, mouse. Plural, mice, okay? So mouse is ratón. Great teacher. Mice is ratones, okay? Yeah? This is only for you to know, solo para que lo sepan, okay, just teacher. for you to know, okay? Thank you very much, Miguel. Thank you very much, okay? Uh, Miguel, can you, can you select a girl? Okay, um, Flor. Okay, Flor, are you ready? Hi, Flor. Yes, teacher. Are you ready? Yes. Yes, okay, Flor, who is the person who fixes damaged equipment? In my company is uh, the technical support. Technical support, okay, that's excellent, very good. Or tech support. What are tech some support. pieces of equipment you have trouble with? And the cable, the cables. Okay. And the, my computer. The cables or, of your computer. Or, or my printer. Only that? Computer or my printer. Oh, yes. ah, okay, the computer oh, yeah. or the printer. Okay, thank you very much, Flor. I appreciate your participation. Can you select a boy, please? Not Miguel, okay? Um, Darwin. Darwin, all right, Darwin. Are you ready? I am ready. Okay, Darwin. Who is the person who fixes damaged equipment? In my company, the pet or part of the machine. For example, is part electrical, is equipment electrical. Okay. Is part mechanic, is equi equipment mechanical. Okay, very good. So I understand. So it depends on the problem. That's your yes, point. It depends, depends on, on the, the problem, problem, right? It depends on the problem. Very good. So what are some pieces of equipment you have uh, trouble with? For example, a machine of the production. Okay. Wally wrap, flex wrap, um, conveyor belt. Okay, very good, conveyor belts. Okay, thank you very much, Darwin. Thank you, everyone, okay? Thank you for your participation. I want to hear everybody, okay? And I guess we want to hear everybody, but we don't have like all the time to do it, okay? Very good. So um, before we go to the next activity, let me pass the attendance quickly, okay? Let's see, Ada Patricia? Present. Adriana. Present. Ana Michelle. Present. Angela. Present. Azalia Melanie. Present teacher. Darwin. Present teacher. Flor. Present teacher. Gloria. Here. Excellent, Carla. Present. Margarita. Present. Very good. Mayra? Present. Nelson? Present, teacher. Ophelia? Here, teacher. Sorry? Here, teacher. Okay. Nelson? Present, teacher. Very good. Osmin? I am here, teacher. Good. Rafael? Rosa? Present. Sandra? Present teacher. Very good. Present. Jancy? Present. Tulma? Present. And Miguel? Present Mar teacher. Present. Maria okay, very Estela, good. teacher. Oh, Maria Estela. I didn't mention Maria Estela. Y le había puesto aquí sí. una asistencia. Okay, Maria? Maria? I'm sorry, Maria. Yeah. I'm really sorry, Maria. Okay? <laughs> it was my problem, okay? I'm sorry about that. Good. Uh, now listen. Uh, just something quickly, okay? Yeah. Solo antes de que se me olvide, antes que se me olvide, ahorita que están conectados todos, solo falta Miguel, solo falta, perdón, Rafael. Okay? Now listen. Escuchen. 
¿Cómo van con el trabajo en la plataforma? Algunos han estado ahí escribiendo, right? Pero se supone que ya mañana, ha, antes de la clase, todos deben, todos deben haber completado los ejercicios, ¿ok? ¿Todos van bien? ¿Everyone's ok? Yes. Sí. Yes. Sure. I finish. Ok. I Only have... this problem is the 14. Yeah. Everybody yes, has the same the problem. Todos, todos tuvieron el mismo problema. Everybody Switch. has the same problem. Yes. Yes, yes, yes right? Yes, teacher. Yes. But it's correct. Solamente it's correct. ese problema. But it's correct, okay? I, I, I swear, lo juro, I swear, it's correct, okay? I swear, it's correct, yeah. Uh, so, los demás, ¿cómo van? En el trabajo de la plataforma, ¿ya listos? Finish, done? Yes, teacher, finish. No, yet. Not yet. Not yet. Mm. Not yet. <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> okay, no, I, but don't I, worry. I have, no. I, have, I have some problems with the 12, I think. He write in affirmative, or negative using oh, really? the really using the past the past parts parts participle the past participle Paris. yes Paris. I, I don't understand okay don't worry in it's for this week right yes uh, i think Only... it was the, the you are talking about the present perfect yes yes so what is confusing for you que fue lo que confundió no entiendo. Dice que dice write in affirmative and negative. Ok. Affirmative, Rose. Number. Only, only that number. Is Rose, missing. remember, uh -huh. if it's present perfect, affirmative is. No, a participle. Past participle. Yes, but it's about the present perfect, right? Yes. 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 Es el verbo en pasado participio, imagino. Yo no lo he visto, uh -huh. pero me imagino yes. que es el verbo. Ah, ¿Cuál verbo has, es? Yes, has or how. Has or has how. how. Y el tú. Depende del de de verbo, el complemento. Yes. Yes. Affirmative and negative. ¿Cuál tarea es, Rose? Una 12, creo que es. No ¿Puede alguien, puedes ponerlo, Rose, para que veamos uh, cuál es el problema? ¿Tú see the problem? Ok, let me find it. Ok, please. So, in the meantime, mientras lo busca Rosa, eh, los que no van ahorita al día, recuerden, mañana, ¿Ah? antes de la clase, deben haber terminado, ok? Que no, no dejen que se les acumule, porque la vez pasada me tocó esperar algunos para poder pasar el, el registro, ok? Y yo sé que todos estamos cansaditos, ok? Everybody's ¿Qué? tired. Así que... Eh, esperar implica de que yo todavía tengo que esperar un poquito más también para ir a descansar. Yo creo que igual ustedes también, ¿verdad? Tienen que desvelarse y también se esfuerzan bastante, ¿ok? Para completar. Así que la idea es que terminemos antes de la clase, que trabajen durante la semana, ¿ok? Yes. Yes. When you mention the problem of 14 tasks, yeah. is, a, is a task number two. Sí, continue the problem. And it does for two. Ah, and switch, and switch off, ah, and switch off. Yeah. Like yeah. The switch, but no. Sure. <coughs> sí, uh -huh. pero siempre but da error. Size 12 uh -huh. are the mentioned rows. Teacher, it's, it's always that error when I put switch off. Yes, yes. that happened to everybody, no. don't worry. But no, ah, pasa todo. Okay. It happened to everybody, okay? Okay. Pero nos queda el 96%, teacher. Sorry. Nos queda el 96% de. Ah. De, de progress. De sí, progress. Pero. Solo voy es a re, tú, voy a la mala, nada más. Okay. Voy a revisar el general a ver si les queda 96. Yo no lo he revisado, but let me check. Ok, just to, to find out. Ajá, voy a revisar a, yo acá okay. a ver cómo quedan. Let me check here. I have ok, I have problem with the. Eh, 12. 12. Eh, Write yes. affirmative and negative sentence using the prompts. Remember Did you find the it, Rose? Rem yes. Rem uh, remember the present perfect to use the present perfect. I write Mario changed the fabric, <laughs> and I think that I write. Can Rosa. you share, Mario? Rosa, has Rosa. No, I can't share. Let me. <clears throat> let me. Okay. La Mario pantalla. has changed. Yes, we want the to see. Fabric. The one. Ah, or, 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 la. Ok, veamos. Sí, les queda 96, Rose. tienen razón. 
Ah, oh, pero a, a Darwin le quedó en 100. A en, ok, let me see. No, no, no. Le quedan 96. Tienen razón. Los que tienen máximo 96, 96, 96. Ok, sí, te le quedan 96. Mario. Ok, let's see. Veamos, Rose. This is no problem. Oh, Mario oh, yes. has. Rose, but in this case, the present perfect is has. Mario Ahí has. en el past perfect. Sería has. Has changed. Ajá, has changed, porque estamos en el, en el present perfect. The products, the production has, hasn't. Ok, stop hasn't. sharing, Rose, stop sharing, please, deja de compartir, stop sharing. Ok, listen, something important, ok, by escuching. En el, present, en el present perfect, recuerden, si es singular, lleva has. Y si es plural o hay, lleva have. Yeah. Okay? Si es tercera persona yes. singular, has. Y el verbo en pasado participio, ¿ok? Has played. Has okay. gone. Y yo les di una listita de verbos, por cierto, en una PPT, ¿recuerdan? Yes. Sí. Ok. Um, así que, Rose, yes. check that. Ok. Hay que revisar ahí entonces. A veces yes. en tercera I, persona... I no, ok. No debe ir it, necesariamente. Puede ser al, algo que sustituya... Un sujeto en singular que sustituye al it. For example, my company. My company es como decir it. ¿Ok? Es en singular. Es en tercera persona de singular. ¿Ok? So you say has. Okay. My company okay. has. ¿Ok? Yes. Yeah. I got it. I got it. Yes. Solo Rosa Three. tenía problemas en esa parte. Me, teacher. Me. At the same. Lo mismo. The same explanation. Okay? La misma explicación. Recuerden hey, yes, la forma. Pero... La fórmula. Recuerden la fórmula. La fórmula para el present perfect era el subject, que puede ser cualquier subject, luego el have o el has. Y luego solo las el... tres. A mí, solo las tres me las acepta. Los demás sí me lo aceptó. Number three. No me lo number three. ¿Qué palabras tienen en la number three, Rose? Can you check, please? Number three. Austin has fixed the, the machine. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay, what did you write? Has fixed. Ajá. A Sandra, ¿cómo escribió usted? Austin has Austin has has. Sandra has, es lo que estamos hablando. En has. tercera persona decimos has. has Austin fixed. es como decir he. Has Ajá, has. Lo compartí en el chat En el chat de In WhatsApp. Ok, thank you very much. Don't forget thank que you. no se... Repito, que no se les olvide que cuando uso he, she, it, usamos el has. Ok, he don't forget that. Yes. Don't forget that, ok? Third person has. Yes. Y si yo digo Austin, it's like saying he. All right, so you say Austin has. Ok? Has. has. Yes, has fixed. Y el verbo en pasado participio, sea con ed... O si es irregular, cambia. Recuerden, ok? Just remember that. Yeah? So, do you have any other question about the, the exercises? El switch off, I'm sorry, I couldn't change it. Eso sí, yo no lo puedo cambiar. I can't change that. Ok? I'm sorry about that. Yes. Because I don't, the problem is that I don't prepare the exercises, ok? Teacher, entonces, en la 12 siempre nos va a quedar una mala. Yo me he comprometido a hacer la consulta y no la he hecho, ok? En la 14, Margarita. En la 14. Ah. Okay. Ajá, yo me he comprometido no a hacer me, la consulta. No me frustro mañana. No, no, it's okay, don't worry. <laughs> Twitch off is correct. I repeat, okay? Y ahora lo vamos a ver eso. So, any other question? <clears throat> no? Okay, let's continue then. Okay, listen. Uh, next, uh, next in, on this part, we have um, a conversation. But before the conversation, I want to tell you something, okay? Listen. I want to tell you something here before the conversation. Listen. Oh my God. Now listen, talking about phrasal verbs, hablando de los phrasal verbs. Pay attention here. Pongamos mucha atención. Pay attention here. Now look, talking about phrasal verbs, talking about phrasal verbs, let me explain something to you. Okay, phrasal verbs are words, son palabras or verbs, son verbos que llevan el verbo the verb and a preposition, okay? The verb and a preposition, okay? 
So phrasal verbs are um, have a verb and a preposition, okay? For example, uh, when you say, um, uh, let me think about one, okay? That is easy. Take after, for example, take, you say take after. After is a preposition, right? Or the adverb, okay? Take after. Oh, let me see. I can say, for example, um, I took after my father. I took after my father. Yo me aparezco a mi papá. So take is tomar, but take after changes the meaning, cambia el significado, okay? It changes the, the meaning, okay? Or I can say, for example, come. Hey, come on, okay? Come on. Come is venir, but come on is different, right? Hey, come on, okay? Vamos, okay? Hey, vamos, okay? Come on, right? So it's different. Or I can say maybe, um, what? Let me think of one using bring. Hurry up. Hurry up, for example, bring. Okay. Bring, solito significa traer. Bring. Mm -hmm. Pero si le pongo el up, bring up, significa crecer a alguien. Bring up someone. Okay, crecer, darle de comer, bring up a child, for example. Crecer it's un niño. Like, it's like give up. Give up, exactly. Hurry up, dijo alguien por ahí, ¿verdad? Yes. Hurry yes. Hurry up, so it's a phrasal verb. Or give up. Give is yeah. dar. Give is dar. Solo give. Right. Pero si digo give up es renunciar, okay? Mm -hmm. O darse por vencido, give up. It's different. So the meaning is different. So basically, the phrasal verbs are composed by a verb and a preposition. Están compuestos por un verbo y una preposición, okay? So please keep this in mind. Mantengan eso en mente. Keep this in mind, okay? This is important. Now, let's look at a conversation with phrasal verbs. So look at this conversation. Okay, look at the conversation. Take a moment and read the conversation, please. Take a moment and read the conversation. Take a moment and read the conversation, please. There is a mistake, okay? Uh, here, instead of a spammer, it's a scanner, okay? It's not spammer. I think it's a scanner, okay? So, I need your help. Can you pass me that scanner? Okay, not spammer. Porque es spammer? I don't know what that is. No sé qué es eso, en realidad. I don't know what that is, okay? So here, the phrasal verbs are involved, okay? Los verbos um, con frases o con preposiciones están en negrita. They are involved, okay? Yes. The meaning of the scanner? Scanner. It's a scanner. Scanner. Thank you. 
teacher, Spanner no es llave inglesa. Spanner. ¿Llave? Llave inglesa, por el contexto que dice, yes. I need. Solo llave. To tighten. Pero tighten, llave. Up, pero tighten up this screw, necesito socar este tornillo. Ajá, entonces necesito una llave, no, no un escáner. Yeah. Ah, Spanner, Spanner, no Spanner. Spanner es una llave inglesa. Uh, yeah. Ok, sí, I didn't know that. Llave, Sinceramente no sabía eso. Y no me, yo lo estuve buscando y no, no me aparecía en, en mi diccionario. Y didn't appear. Eh, yo recuerdo que en el módulo anterior dieron esas, eh, aparecieron pues en, ah, okay. en una de las. Ajá, entonces ahí eran varias herramientas. Ok, Spanner is right. Y Spanner estaba dentro de eso. Ok. Ok, let me check. Voy a revisar entonces en otro diccionario. Let me check in another dictionary. Oh, yeah, you're right. Tienes razón. Spanner is llave inglesa. Llave, ok. Yeah, you're, you're correct. Tienes razón, Miguel. Thank you very much. Llave inglesa. Llave, Spanner. ajá, una llave. Ok. Bueno, esa llave inglesa es como una perica o cómo es? How is it? It's like cangreja. Cangreja, una cangreja. Ah, esa, es, esa es otra, esa es otra. Esa es otra. Es otra. Let me check it. La, Let me la, check la, it. La inglesa es la de fontanero normalmente. Oh my God. La range. Okay. Esa es como la range, entonces. Algo así se llama una range. Una, como un range que le decimos así. Ah, no, pero esa es la perica. Esta es la perica. La, la España. Es parecida a la perica porque tiene, eh, tiene un... un algo regulatorio que, um, que, sí, uh -huh. que va bajando la, la dentadura. Uh -huh. no, se parece uh -huh. Because here I uh -huh. esa parte uh -huh. de en medio. Tiene el tornillito Ajá, sí, Ajá. Es la uh -huh. Pone llave inglesa. No le saldría uh -huh. la llave inglesa. Sí. Lo que yes. Yo la conozco como llave perica. <ríe> I don't know if it's I'm the only one. No sé si soy el único. I don't know if I'm the only one. No. <ríe> Banner. Ajá. La, la llave perica. inglesa es como de fontanero. Es, es diferente. Es que yo puse Spanner y esta me aparece en Pictures, en Google. Sí, probablemente sea esta, teacher, la que está Ajá, en el okay. contexto de ahí. Está Ajá, bien. Ajá. Sí, porque está sale como igual sirve para apretar un tornillo. Yo la veo como cangreja. Sí. Como una cangreja. Es, esa es la que nosotros sí. llamamos cangreja. Ajá. Ah, okay. Esa que está ahí. Es I don't know about you. Es esta de acá entonces. Sí, sí. Sí, era cangreja. <risa> ok. Es, es esa que tiene que haber el tornillo medio regulatorio, Ajá. pero hay ah. otro tipo también. Ah, ok. <risa> esa es el spanner. Yes. yes. Ah, ok. It's new for me. I learned something with you. Ahora sí aprendí algo con ustedes. I learned something with you. Thank you very much. Muchas gracias. Thank you very much. Ok, Ok, very good. So, uh, so let's check, okay? So here uh, we have uh, the conversation and we have some phrasal verbs, okay? The idea is to pay attention to the phrasal verbs, okay? So please uh, listen to the pronunciation first. Okay, listen to the pronunciation, please. Tom, I need your help. Can you pass me that spanner, please? I need to tighten up this screw. Sure, here you go. Thanks a lot. Look, did Kit clean up the room before he left? Yes, he did. I know he did because I asked him to switch off the power. Great. By the way, did you call up the electrician? The engine doesn't stop to turn off. And now we have a problem. Yeah, I think that if you don't oil it regularly, it will seize up even eventually. That's correct. Okay, listen again. Tom, I need your help. Can you pass me that spanner, please? I need to tighten up this screw. Sure, here you go. Thanks a lot. Look, did Kit clean up the room before he left? Yes, he did. I know he did because I asked him to switch off the power. Great. By the way, did you call up the electrician? The engine doesn't stop to turn off. And now we have a problem. Yeah, I think that if we don't oil it regularly, it will seize up eventually. That's correct. Okay, now please, I will stop here.
So in this part, uh, the idea now is that you practice only the pronunciation, okay? So we will go to breakout rooms and you will practice only the pronunciation in pairs, okay? I will give you four minutes. In four minutes, practice the conversation, but don't stop. No dejen de practicar. Don't say I finish, okay? No digan ya terminé. Don't say I finish. Continue, continue, practice, 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 and practice again. Four minutes, okay? Are you ready? Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, okay. yeah, okay, perfect. Let's go and practice. Are you, is Ulma here, Jansi? Yes. Ah, okay. Hi, search the book. Ah, okay. Um, wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Okay. Um, you... That is you don't know oil link regu regulating in it will sign up eventually. That's correct. Teacher uh, pronunciation in regularly, regularly, Reg regular, huh? regularly, regularly. Regular. Regularly. Regularly. Uh, regular. 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 Yes. Regularly. Regularly. Eventually? Eventually? Yeah, eventually. Eventually. Um time time tighten up. Tighten up. Tighten up. Tighten up. Screw. 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 Ah, okay. Um Switch off. Switch off. Switch off. Switch off. Switch off. Switch off the switch. power. Switch off switch. the power. Uh, switch off. Uh -huh. Switch off. Switch off. Switch off. Screw. 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 Mm -hmm. Screw. Spider. Screw. Screw. Uh, Light yes. out. Clean out. Uh, what? Clean out. Clean up. Clean up. Clean up. Clean up. Clean up. Clean. Clean up. Regularly. Esta es la palabra aquí. Es difícil. Es es dificultosa para mí. It's hard. It's difficult. You can say. It's difficult. Um, yeah. Regular, regu regularly. Regularly. Regularly? Regularly. 
Regularly. Regularly. Lar. Largely. Largely. Regularly. Regularly. You need more practice. Regularly. 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 Yes. Regularly. Yes. Regularly. Regularly. <gasps> Regu regularly. It's call up. Call up. Call up. Call up. Call up. The electrician. Call up. Engine. The engine. Engine. In which part? Teacher? In which part? In which part? Um, ah, after electrician. Engine. Uh -huh. ah, the engine. Yes. The engine doesn't stop to turn off. The engine. Engine. The, the engine. engine. The okay. engine. Ah, uh, the engine. Regular. Okay. Esa palabra me tiene preocupada. Okay. Thank you. Ah, uh, practice. Ah, uh, start me. Así se lleva. ¿En qué se yo? Okay. Okay. Tom, I need your help. Can you pass me? Pass me. That's partner, please. I need to tighten up the screw. Screen. Screw? Screw. 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 Sure. Here you go. Um, thank you. A lot look, a lot look, did you clean, clean up? The room before he left. He left. He left. He left. He left. Yes, he did. I know he did because I asked asked him to switch off the power. Great. By the way, did you call the call up the electrician? The engineer doesn't. Thanks. A lot of, a lot, a lot did keep clean up the room before he left. Yes, he did. I know he did because I asked him to, to switch off the power. Great. By the way, did you call up the electrician? The engineer doesn't stop the turn off. Um, not we had the problem. Yeah. I think that if you don't oil it regularly, it will save up eventually. That's correct. Teacher, what is the pronunciation regular? It's regularly. 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 Yes. Regularly. Okay. Is the pronunciation one? is yeah? I think that if you don't oil it regularly, it will seize up eventually. Eventually. Regularly. In, in other words, time uh, step tightens up. Tighten up. Tighten up. up. Tighten up. Tighten up. Okay. okay. Uh, you start, Maria Estela. Okay. Tom, I need your help. Can you pass me that spanner, please? I need to tighten that this screen. Sure. Here you go. Thanks a lot. Look, did keep clean up the room. Here you go. That's a lot, Luke. Did kid clean up the room before he left? Yes, he did. I know he did because I asked him to switch off the power. Great, by the way, did you call up the electrician? The agenda doesn't stop to turn off and now we have a problem. Yeah, I think that if you don't oil it regularly, it will size up eventually. That's correct. <laughs> okay, boy from day. Tom, I need your help. Can you pass me that spanner, please? I need to tighten up this screw. Sure, here you go. 
Thanks a lot. Luke did Kit clean up the room before he left? Yes, he did. I know he did because I asked him to switch off the power. Great. By the way, did you call up the electrician? The engine doesn't stop to turn off. And now we have a problem. Yeah, I think that if you don't oil it regularly, it will size up eventually. That's correct. Okay. Um, yeah, no vez, or... <laughs> bueno, <laughs> ya casi nos vamos. Ya Okay, everyone. I know uh, for this conversation, there is some vocabulary which is very difficult, right? To pronounce, okay? Yes. So uh, yes. we will check some vocabulary. Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. Can you, can you repeat the... The conversation? The all, all the conversation. The sentence, okay, first, 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 tell me some vocabulary that is difficult for you to pronounce. Mm, tighten up. Tighten up, okay? Tight up. Okay. Tighten, Tighten up. What else? Come on. Regularly. Okay. Uh, let's see here. What is regularly? Uh, engine electrician, the engine me, no sé. Okay. Algo así. Electrician, <laughs> engine, and somebody's helping me. I don't know. Size up. Size up. Size up. Size up. Size up. Uh, ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Spanner. 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 Did kid clean up? Ah, sí, did kid clean up? Did kid clean up the room, ok? Did kid clean up. Good. I asked, ok, very good. ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Tinto sweet. Switch off. Switch off. Switch off. Switch off. Switch off. Call, call, call. Call. Oh my God. All the, call. All, the all the conversation. All the conversation. All the conversation. Tighten up. All the conversation. Repeat. Yes, tighten up. Tighten up. Okay. Again. Tighten up. Tighten up. Tighten up. Switch off. Okay. Now, please, uh, let's repeat, repeat only the words now, I underline. Please. Okay. Let's repeat only It's the slow. words I no. underline. Vamos a repetir todo, pero con el micrófono apagado, please, para que no haya interferencias. Okay. So you listen very good, okay? Only the vocabulary I underline right now. Ahorita solo lo subrayado, okay? So let's start. Empecemos. Spanner. 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 Tighten up. Tighten up. Tighten up. Tighten up. Teacher. Yes. Podría escribir el Titan. Es de que este se, se pronuncia de una vez. Tighten up. Yes. Tighten, tighten up. up. Tighten up. Okay. Okay. Tighten. Yes. Like, like tighten. Tighten up. Like tighten. Tighten up. Uh -huh. Tighten up. Okay. Tighten up. Yes. Okay. Yes. Tighten up. Ok, let's continue, continuemos. Screw. 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 Did kid clean up? Did kid clean up? Did kid clean up? Aquí se unen los sonidos. Clean up. Did kid clean up? Ask. Ask. Switch off. Switch off. Switch off. Unimos los sonidos igual. Switch off. Chof. Chof. So you say switch off. Switch off. Sorry. Switch off. Call up. The same, you connect the sounds, lo mismo, unimos los sonidos, call up, call up, call up, call up, call up, 
electrician, 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 engine, 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 regularly, 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 don't oil it, don't oil it. Don't oil it. In this case, don't oil it. Toda la oración, if you don't oil it, es si no le echas aceite. If you don't oil it. O si no la aceitas. Okay? If you don't oil it. Si no la aceitas. Okay? If you don't oil it regularly. Okay, let's continue. Seize up. Seize up. Seize up. Seize up. Seize up. Seize up. Seize up, seize up. Eventually, 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 eventually. Okay, now let's pronounce all the conversation. Ahora pronunciamos la toda, okay? The same with the microphone off. Siempre con el micrófono apagado, okay? Always with the microphone off, please, okay? Let's start with Dave. Tom, I need your help. Can you pass me this? Can you pass me that spanner, please? I need to tighten up this screw. I need to tighten up this screw. Sure, here you go. Thanks a lot. Look. Did Kit clean up the room before he left? Look, did Kit clean up the room before he left? Yes, he did. I know he did because I asked him to switch off the power. Okay, let's repeat this part again. Yes, he did. I know he did because I asked him to switch off the power. Great. By the way, did you call up the electrician? The engine doesn't stop to turn off. And now we have a problem. Yeah, I think that if you don't oil it regularly, it will seize up eventually. Okay, that's correct, okay, that's correct. Very good. Now listen up, now listen. And uh, now let's pay attention to the, in context, let's pay attention to the meaning of the phrasal verbs. Pongamos atención al significado de los phrasal verbs, okay? In context, I need to tighten up this screw. What is tighten up? Apretar. 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 Apretar este tornillo. I need to tighten up, okay? I need to tighten up. Necesito apretar. I need to tighten up this screw, okay? Good. What is clean up according to the context? Limpiar. Limpiar. Yeah. Organizar, yeah. okay? Limpiar, organizar. Good. Clean up. Very good. What is switch off? Apagar. 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 So you say switch off the computer. Switch off the cell phone, okay? Switch off. Apagar. What is call up? Llamar. Llamar. Llamar in this case, okay? Llamar, contactar, okay? Good. What is turn off? 
Apagar. 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 It's like switch off, okay? It's como el switch off. Switch off and turn off son sinónimos. They're synonyms, okay? Good. Now let's go to seize up. What is seize up? Visitar. Sorry? Medir. 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 Check the context. Si no, lo, si no lo aceptas. Visitar. Ah, si no lo, si no lo aceptas. Si no ok, lo listen. It says, ok, it says, I think, pienso que si, lo, si no lo aceitas regularmente, ¿qué pasará? Es que paraliza. Se va a paralizar. Ah, exactly. Se va a trabar, ok, se trabará o se, o se paralizará, ok. Or may, or may, ajá, uh -huh. it will get stuck. Or maybe you can say, um, sí, se trabará. O tal vez se detendrá, dejará de trabajar, ok. Yeah. Good. Uh, so we have... Some phrasal verbs. Now, remember the conversation and check these questions. Okay, question number one. What seems to be the problem? What is the problem in the conversation? What is the problem in the conversation? Problem with the machine. Tighten up this screen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they need to tighten up a screw, but what is the problem? <laughs> A machine doesn't work. A machine doesn't work. Mm -hmm. No. Um. Check the conversation. What is the problem with the conversation? In the conversation. Necesita apretar el tornillo. Ah, there is a problem with the screw. Hay un problema con un tornillo. A loose screw. Un tornillo flojo. A loose screw. Okay. Yes. A loose screw. That's right. Second question. What kinds of jobs do you think Dave and Tom have? In the conversation, we have Dave and Tom, right? What do you think is their job at the company? Engineer. Engineer. The motor no se detiene. Electrician. Electrician. The engine. Ah, the engine. Ah, the engine doesn't stop is the problem. It says the uh, engine. The engine doesn't stop. Yes. Okay, Miguel. Yes, very good. It's because of the because yes. they don't oil it. Okay, that's what that's the problem. Very good. Now. Uh, what do you think are the positions of Dave and Tom at the company? What is their job? Dave is the boss. Somebody said electricians. Do you think they are electricians? The motor no. The production no. supervisor, maybe. Mm -hmm. Maybe supervisors? Yeah, supervisors. Yes, maybe they are supervisors, maybe. Okay. Or electricians, okay? Maybe, no, right? We don't know. No, no because they no. say because they the ah, no, because they, they want they to call, they want to call up the electricians. Very the good. Electrician. Mm -hmm. Exactly, yeah. exactly. So probably they mm -hmm. are they are engineers or or supervisors, right? Yes. Or and I think or technicians. Or technicians, exactly. That's right. Okay, now let's go and check. Question number three. Uh, who is in charge of checking the machinery and equipment in your company? The electrician, the technicians, who is in charge in your company? Who is in charge of checking the machinery in your company? Technician. The technicians, okay, the technicians. Technicians, sorry, sorry, Miguel. 220 and 110. What is that? 110 or 20? This is the la carga? No. El... Char cargado de chequear la maquinaria. No, no, no. no. no the problem no, is no. No, no, no. Es, es otra cosa. Yes. No, no, in charge. no, ¿quién revisa la maquinaria? Who checks the machinery? Who is in charge of checking the machinery? Uh, the mechanics. Okay, the mechanics, the mechanics, the technicians. If it depends in, a, in the company, it depends. depends. It depends on the company and the equipment, uh -huh. right? Yes. If, if, if it is a yeah. telephone problem, is the technician. Yes, it's oh. a technician. Uh -huh, in something oh, really. It's, it's, it's a technician that uh -huh, that looks. Communication that, technician. Yeah, uh -huh, yeah communication. Uh -huh, we can say a communication <laughs> technician. That's right. Thank you, yes. Carla. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> so if, if it's an electricity problem, it's an electrician, right? Yes. Uh -huh. yes. It depends. Or maybe it's a mechanical problem, it's a mechanic, okay? The mechanic. So, yes. the mechanic. Or maybe if it's a problem with um 
with welding uh, con soldadura, maybe the welder, el soldador, the, com the, the welder. Problem with the computers, the IT. The IT, that's right. So it depends, mm -hmm. right? It depends on yeah, the problem. Very good. Problem. Now, look at this. Aquí sí pongamos mucha atención. Pay a lot of attention here. Okay, I said, right, that a phrasal verb is made by using a verb and a preposition, okay? And look, check this. Tighten. According to the conversation, this phrasal verb tighten is tighten up. up. What is tighten, tighten up? Tighten up. What is tighten up? Yes. Apretar. 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 What about switch? Did you say switch, switch up or switch, switch, off? switch, switch off. off? Switch off. Switch off. Switch what off. is switch off? Apagar. 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 So obviously, yes. clean up, right? Clean up. Okay. Clean up. Yeah. Clean up. Yeah. Limpiar. Limpiar. Yeah. Limpiar. Yeah. Limpiar. Yeah. Ordenar, okay? You can say even. Clean up. Okay, clean up. What about C's? Pesa up. Pesa up. Pesa up. What is this up? Paralizar. 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 Trabarse. Trabarse. Okay. You can say maybe uh, the printer seized up. <laughs> Se detuvo. Se trabó. Okay, seized up. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Now, what is turn turn up or turn off? Turn off. Turn off. Turn off. Turn off. Turn off is like switch off. Apagar. Turn off your cell phone. Okay. And call up. What is call up? Llamar. Llamar. Contactar. Okay. Call up. Okay. Call up. Very good. So we have six phrasal verbs. Okay. Tenemos seis verbos con frases. Six phrasal verbs. So with prepositions. Okay. Now listen. Now you know the definition, okay? The idea is that in this moment, you write the correct phrasal verb on this space, okay? So this exercise is on page number 36. For example, number one is, can you pass me that spanner? I need to tighten up, tighten up this bolt, this bolt, okay? Number two, this workshop is very dirty. Let's clean up. Okay, okay, don't tell me, okay? So please. Don't tell me. So this exercise is on page number uh, 36, okay? Yeah, so this is the last activity we're doing today. So work in pairs, please. Vamos a trabajar en parejas. Page number 36, página 36, okay? Page number 36. So let's work in pairs. Trabajemos en parejas. Let's work in pairs. So, okay. Sí, ahorita le comparto, déme un minuto. Okay. Bueno. No. You see my screen. Yes. Number two is it's a good shop. We shop. We shop. Number three, clean up. Que, oh, no. Me pasé la página. Pero creo que la voz habíamos dicho que era clean up. Porque ¿Sí? dice que está sucio. Clean up. Ajá. Uh -huh. Oh my God, perdí la página. Ahí está. Maya. La dos era clean up. La tres podría ser. Number three, number off. one, number two, number three, number four. Number three. <laughs> In English. Could be switch off. Yes. And number four, I hope the computer won't. Sin, 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 s
five. Turn off, collapse, see sub La cuatro, ¿cuál es? Sí, sub. Seas, ajá, seas up. Seas up, ajá. ¿Y la cinco? Turn off. Dice... Ok. We need to... Ok, y la seis sería call up. Sí. Yes. You finish the homework. Eh, teacher, uh, <laughs> yeah, 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 tell me, tell me. <laughs> you said teacher? No. <laughs> no. Ah, I heard teacher. Oh my god. Vamos a complementar la uno de la uno a la seis, ¿verdad, teacher? Yes, only that, solo eso, only that. Okay. No. Aparte de lo del cuadrito, abajo. Toda la no, no, no. Frase. Only from one to six, solo esa de la uno a la seis, only that. Uh -huh. Ah. Only that. So you finished, ¿ok? Yes. Yes. Ok. Finish, Darwin. Finish. Hi. Hello. Yes, teacher. Okay, so let's go back then. Regresemos entonces. Let's go back then. Okay. Okay, everyone. Oh my God, no han regresado todos. We have some people missing. Hey, let's wait for them. Esperemos entonces. Let's wait for them. Hi, Rafa. It's good to see you. I, uh, I connected late. Yes. But it's good to see you. <laughs> Okay. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Okay. Very good. So let's uh let's check. Let's check what you have. Okay. Who wants to share number one? Quickly, no, number me, one. Me, okay. teacher. Adriana, Adriana, number one. Share, please. Comparte. Okay. Eh, la number one sería number two. Okay. Number two. Sorry, number two. <laughs> All right. This workshop is very dirty. Let's clean up this place. So you have clean up. Clean up. Clean up. Yeah. Do you have the same, everybody? Yes? Yes. Okay, yes. perfect. Okay, let's see yes, number teacher. three. Number three? Me? Okay, Angela. Remember to switch off the power before you renew the machine. So you have switch off. Switch yes, off. teacher. Switch off. Switch off. Does switch everybody off. have switch yes. off? Yeah, okay, excellent. Yes, That's pretty really good. Number four. Thank you, Angela. Number four. Thank you, teacher. I hope. Four. I hope the computer won't turn off again. I hope the computer won't turn off again. Turn off. So you have turn off. Turn off, okay? So does everybody turn have turn off? Turn off. Yes, yes. No? Turn teacher. Off. Okay. Yes, yes, okay. yes, teacher. Okay, that's excellent. So the answer is turn off. Next. Siguiente, next. Number five. Number five was me. Okay. Says up. Okay, but read the, read the sentence. Lea la tot. Read it all. Okay. Okay. Uh, if you, if you, if you don't, Lubricate this type of machine re re regularly, they will seize up. They will seize up. So you have seize up. All right. So does everyone have seize up? Yes. 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 Great. Way to yes, go. Excellent. Teacher. 
And number six, la última para irnos a dormir, the last one to go to bed. <laughs> or we don't have number six. Or we have number Me six. Teacher. Okay, Margarita. 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 The printer just stopped working. We need to call up a technician. We need to call up a technician. So do you have call up everyone? Yes. 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 Oh, that's yes, very good. Thank you very much. Okay. So everyone, so basically today uh, we started phrasal verbs. We started like six or eight phrasal verbs. But the reality is that we have many phrasal verbs. We have many phrasal verbs in English. Okay. So if you ask me, teacher, but how do I know? How do I know that it's a phrasal verb? By heart. Igual que los verbos irregulares deben memorizarlos. You have to memorize them. It's the only way. Es la única forma. Tal vez algunos en el contexto lo vamos a entender, pero no todos. Not all of them, all right? So the idea is that you memorize them. Okay? That you learn them. So if you want, si alguien tiene alguna lista, o yo puedo buscar una lista de verbos, eh, de phrasal verbs, y la puede compartir, or I can share one with you in PDF, okay? O les puedo compartir una yo en PDF en el grupo. Okay? In the office, my computer. Sorry? I have a, in, in the office, my computer. I, I list. You have a list? Yes, in my computer, in the oh. office. Okay, maybe you can share tomorrow. Okay. okay Teacher, I have much. a question. Yes. Eh, esos verbos se pueden conjugar. Así yes, of pasado. course, of course, oh. in present, in past, in present, perfect. For example, you say tighten up. In the present, you say tighten up, okay? But in the past, you say tightened with ED. I tightened mm -hmm. up, okay? I tightened up some balls yesterday in past, okay? Or in present, perfect. I have tightened up some balls today, all right? So yes, you, you can conjugate them, okay? Pero solo se conjuga la primera parte, que es la, la mm -hmm. del verbo. Okay. Yes. Okay. La parte yes. de la preposición yes. esa no se conjuga. You don't conjugate mm -hmm. that. Okay. Okay. Example: uh, calling up. Ah, exactly. You say called, called mm -hmm. in the past, okay. right? Or we'll call in the future. Okay. So you can conjugate. Se pueden conjugar. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank okay. you. All right. Any other question? Recordatorio nada más. Mañana antes de la clase deben dejar, deben tener terminadas ya las. La, las tareas o las, las tareas de la semana 3, por favor, ok, please, ok ok, so thank you everyone for connecting today thank you very much, solo se queda Ada creo que tiene la sesión, oh the attendance así es, teacher, the attendance, the attendance the attendance, ok, let me, let me do it okay. quickly porque ya vino Rafa, ok so we have Rafa here, Ada Ada, Patricia, Present, una pregunta Dígame, pues, podemos cambiar el día Present. Adriana, sí está bien no hay problema Present teacher. Que me toca Ana mañana. Michelle. Present teacher. Está bien, Nelson. Este, lo hago yo mañana y usted lo hace hoy. Ángela. Okay. Gracias. Okay. Ángela. <risa> Azalia. Present teacher. Darwin. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. <risa> Flor. <risa> Flor, she left. Okay. Gloria. Uh, here. Carla. Present. Margarita. Present. Maria. Present, teacher. Mayra. Present, teacher. Nelson. Present. Ofelia. Yes, teacher. Osmin. Present, teacher. Good night. Rafael. Good night. Rafael. Present. Good night. Good night, Rosa. Present. Sandra. Present. Chancy. Present. Okay. Sulma. Present. And Miguel. And Miguel. Present teacher. All right. So thank you Present. everyone for staying. Good night. Goodbye. Take care. Good and see you night. tomorrow. Good okay. Night. Bye bye. Solo se queda Ada. Solo se queda Ada. Good night. Good night. Teacher, con, con Nelson acabamos de cambiar de día. Él lo va a hacer ahora y yo lo voy a hacer mañana. Okay. Esa era la plática. Ah, okay. Okay. <laughs> thank you. Excuse me, teacher. Yeah, it's okay. Qué mente. Bye. Good night. Bye bye. Good night. Good night.
No me puedo salir. Ok, Nelson. So, así que fueron planes de última hora. Y yo, tipo, ¿qué, ¿qué será lo que están planeando ahí, ser? <risa> es que mañana voy a estar bastante atareado y voy a, me va a complicar un poco. It's ok, no problem. Okay? Tengo una reunión, pero voy a tratar de estar en la clase, pero para la eh, face to face, un mmm, poco más complicado. Pero okay. me, me ayudó. Ada. Ok, I understand. Ok, thank so you. Nelson, this space is for you. So if you have any questions, it's your moment. Ok. Eh, the class is, mm, is good, but uh, I, I had the problem is um, um, traduction or Einstein the the when when the when the you or other 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 class is is talks only English. Okay. Uh, I, I difficult for me. I ah, hear because uh, I I I practice we we hear music music or video is good but it's difficult for me it here okay okay uh when you listen you say you listen to music right yeah mm -hmm. so yeah. Ba basically uh what you are telling me is that you have problems listening and understanding yes. right yeah. listening and understanding what you listen okay yeah. so i ha i have a question i mean music is really good music is really good but you listen to music right but what else yes. do you do? ¿Qué más haces con la música? What else do you do with the music? Eh, la, la escribo y ando practicando, eh, tarareando, la llamo. Okay. Pero, pero sí me sirve, pero no, no, no como, o sea, ¿cómo le digo? No a, a un porcentaje alto. Sí, algunas casas, porque cuando está la, la música combinan diferentes tiempos y a veces hasta cuesta, me cuesta entender hasta que a veces la traduzco. Okay. Cuando, estoy, cuando estoy hablando, cuando estoy escuchando conversaciones largas, eh, se me hace bastante difícil entender así. Pues, entiendo una parte, digamos, algunas cositas, pero no todo. En mi lugar de trabajo, pues, hay veces tengo que comunicarme con los proveedores y solo inglés me cuesta, entonces eh, esa parte no la supero. Yo ya he estado estudiando por otro tiempo, ¿verdad? Pero eh, al no practicar uno con el tiempo se le olvidan muchas cosas. Mm -hmm. I understand. Ok, good. Yeah. So, um, I, I've been analyzing, right? He estado analizando, I've been analyzing, ¿ok? Y lo que siento que falta es vocabulario. Vocabulario. Vocabulary, ok. Lo más, más bien lo que yo siento que falta es vocab vocabulario, ok. Y un poquito de gramática. Vocabulario y un poquito de gramática, ok. And a little grammar, ok. Good. Muy bien. Ahora bien, escuchas la canción, la traduces, pero, ok, aparte de eso, eh, ¿te aprendes las palabras de la canción? Sí, ok. Para mí, eh, para mí, digamos, es bien interesante poder entender lo que estoy diciendo en una en una melodía, o sea, uh -huh. lo que dice, porque hay diferentes letras, pero sí la voy entendiendo. Ok. La voy entendiendo, pero eh, siempre, y he, lo he hecho por mucho tiempo, pero cuando estoy en las conversaciones largas, me cuesta poder descifrar, digamos, lo que, lo que me están diciendo. Ok, vaya, entonces hay que hacer una cosa, es de, es de cambiar el, el sistema, ok. Es de cambiar el sistema. No nos no, no vamos a enfocar en música. Eh, nos vamos a enfocar en conversaciones entonces, porque your problem is when speaking, when listening yeah. to someone, like having a conversation, ¿ok? Muy bien, yeah. vamos a hacer entonces lo, lo siguiente. Eh, voy a buscar una página, ahorita no tengo una porque es primera vez que escucho este, eso. Tengo algunas, pero para otra clase de, digamos, de, de, de problemas en el idioma. Vale, voy a buscar una página que tenga conversaciones en inglés, conversaciones diferentes, de diferentes temas, ¿ok? Y Voy a revisar que tengan audio. ¿Ok? Ok. Ok. Y vas a practicar una técnica que se llama shadowing, que yo la sugiero siempre. ¿En qué consiste el shadowing? Consiste en escuchar la conversación, en este caso, escucharla varias veces. 
You listen to it many times, ¿ok? Hasta que yo siento que manejo la pronunciación. Cuando siento que la manejo, voy a tratar de seguir al speaker, al que va pronunciando la... Pongo play en la conversación y voy repitiendo a la parte del speaker. Así, a la par. ¿Ok? Hasta que yo lo hago exactamente a la par de él, con buena pronunciación, ¿ok? Así como él lo pronuncia. Y voy a ir buscando okay. vocabulario de esa conversación. Y vamos a ver si esto ayuda después de un cierto tiempo, pero necesito buscar el sitio web primero, con conversaciones, con audio, ¿ok? Y eso te va a ayudar, sí. porque el problema es en, en entablar conversaciones. Sí, exacto. Ok, so vamos a hacer eso, porque la, la canción no es una conversación, sino que es algo que Ajá. escucho en general. Pero si escuchamos sí. conversaciones y hacemos esto, siento que puede ayudar más. ¿Ok? Sí, yo me, me o sea, me, me trato de, 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 de informar, en la, de como comenté ya, de, en, en el ¿cómo se llama? Instagram, hay mucha, me mandan información, me mandan lo de screen, de, de gramática y todo eso, pero ya estar face to face en una conversación, allí me dificulta. Okay. Es lo que, lo que quiero superar. Vamos a hacer eso entonces. We are going to do that, ¿ok? Y hay que hacerlo de esa manera. Si ya manejas una conversación, empiezas con otra, y luego otra, y luego otra, y luego otra, y luego otra, ¿ok? Sin aburrirte de hacerlo. Sí. Y seguramente esto, como ya es dos personas hablando, esto te va a ayudar a mejorar porque, o sea, en este caso eres tú y otra persona hablando. No es solo un Exacto. cantante hablando, no eres solo Exacto. tú hablando, solo la otra persona hablando, ¿ok? Hay que ver maneras de contestar, ahí aparecen en las conversaciones. La idea es que tú manejes bien ese vocabulario de la conversación, ¿ok? Y sí, la pronunciación. Me voy, a, me voy a, 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 a preparar más con vocabulario, porque sí, quizás eso me ayuda. Me Trabajemos con el mismo vocabulario de las conversaciones. Voy a buscar yo un sitio, ¿ok? Y, yo, y me escribes un mensajito tú. Ok, eh, Bernardo, soy Nelson, me sugiere el sitio de las conversaciones, por favor. Así para, para, para yo mandártelo directo, ¿ok? Para recordar, ¿ok? Mm -hmm. Ok. Good Yo creo que eh, eh, de la clase le digo, eh, me gusta y, y sí, estoy aprendiendo bastante, pero okay, very good. en esa parte eh, todavía que no, no la logro superar. Ok, vamos a trabajar en eso entonces. Ok, teacher. Good. Ok, ok, good thank night. you. Ok, good night and goodbye. Bye. Bye bye. Bye.